Well, one of the great biblical stories is the story of the Red Sea. Well, now let's change that a bit. What are the Red Seas of your life that have stopped you, where the enemy seems to be coming towards you, and you have, you have nothing but uh, uh, real challenge, barriers in front of you, and you don't know how to get out of the jam, the situation, and the problem. God has a course mapped out for your life, my friend, and all the inadequacies in the world will not change God's mind. God will be with you every step of the way, and though it may take time, God has a celebration planned for you. When you cross over the Red Seas, of your own life. In Psalms 32 verse 8, the Bible says this, I will instruct you and teach you in the way you should go. I will guide you with my eye. God has plans for your life, my friend, that are grander than you can even imagine. You know, I look back on my life, I could not have imagined all this. There's no way that my human mind could have come up with this. But God's eye knew, and God's eye guided. Now, sometimes God's plans may not be clear to you. They certainly weren't clear to me. But sometimes God will lead you through the wilderness before God delivers you to the promised land. So be patient, keep praying, and keep seeking God's will for your life when you do. You will be amazed at the marvelous things that an all-powerful, all-knowing God can do. Are you determined to discover God's plan for your life? Are you willing to work, to pray, to watch, and to listen? If so, God's Word promises that God will lead you along a path of God's choosing. And God's choosing and God's will is always the highest and the best of good. So that you can be assured that God's path will be perfect for you, already prepared and waiting for you. God bless you.